In dark shirts, kick off against England at Cardiff Arms Park. A capacity crowd of 56,000 is there for this traditional rugby clash. Left winger Brewer throws in for Wales. Woodward, number two, is quick to pounce, but back comes Brewer to bundle him into touch. From a scrum, the Welsh three-quarter line gets moving. The ground, which has taken a beating from rain and snow, is far from ideal and won't allow absolutely top-class rugby. Willis to Cliff Morgan and Wales are away. Ken Jones takes over. This is his 36th successive game for Wales, a new native record. Taylor gets himself offside and the ref immediately awards a penalty. Edwards, a last-minute deputy for Owen, takes it and it's over. Lim Hall feels the ball. Wales still lead by three points to nil when play resumes after half-time. Baisley tries a run for England, but as on so many occasions, the Englishmen never complete the job successfully. Time and again they miss scoring by little more than a hair's breadth. The match enters its final moments and England haven't given up hope yet. But once more the Welsh defence don't let them through. The fight goes on right up to the whistle, in fact past it. But England can't alter the score. 3-0 it stays. And perhaps even a Welshman might admit the Englishmen were just a trifle unlucky.